Have you ever used Google Scholar and found an article you want, only to discover you can only get the abstract? This tutorial will show you how to use Google Scholar to find out if CSUN has access to the full text of an article. Let's start by going to the Google Scholar homepage, scholar.google.com. If you run a search right now, Google Scholar doesn't know you are associated with CSUN. To get access to CSUN resources, you'll need to tell Google Scholar you're a CSUN student by selecting Settings from the Google Scholar homepage, located in the upper right corner. Then select Library Links on the left. Type CSUN in the search box, and then select Search. Underneath Show Library Access Links For, there is now a checkbox called CSU Northridge SFX Find It at CSUN. Select this checkbox, and then select Save at the top or bottom of the page. After saving your preferences, you're taken back to the Google Scholar homepage. Now when you run a search, like for climate change and drinking water, your search results will have CSUN specific links either SFX Find It at CSUN to the right of the article, or SFX Additional Options below the article. If you click on these new links, such as the one for the second search result, it takes you to a new page showing you if we have access to the article. For this article, there's a link that starts with Full Text Available Via, and then lists one of the library's databases. This means we have the full text of the article online, and you can select this link to access the full text. You may also see a link saying, we have this, check holdings in CSU Northridge catalog. This means that we have the article in print and you'll need to come to the library to get the full text of the article. If you have any questions about using Google Scholar, remember that you can always ask a librarian.